Hi, Celia. How you doing? Thanks so much for kicking things off. It's difficult to post first always, so thanks for taking the lead on that. Um, I've got your ad up here. The first thing I noticed is that if you take a look at your logo, it's been stretched. Um, looks like it's been horizontally stretched to fit the, the space you have allotted for it. If we take a look at the logo from the style guide and then look at yours that you have placed, you can clearly see that it's it's a completely different shape, size and shape. So you definitely don't, don't whenever you place something, you always want to keep uh, maintain the, the original, you know, constrain the original proportions of the image um, or the graphic that you place in any any piece. Okay, so that's going to have to be replaced. The image looks good, nice, nice treatment, um, good good image quality. Um, this logo right here, or this I'm sorry, this headline right here is kind of a, obscuring a good portion of the image. So I'm not real sure that's the best place for that particular type. It seems like down here would be a little bit of an easier fit. Um, and then from the the central point down in the ad, it just kind of it just kind of takes a different turn. Um, you start out so classy up here with this beautiful, you know, colored image and then the logo. And then all of a sudden, you have just this giant clip out coupon um, that kind of looks like something that comes from your your local, you know, clipper ad, clipper saver um, ad that comes in, at, to your house. So so this is not a good treatment for a magazine ad, I think. Keep in mind, it's a multi-million dollar client. Um, they're not going to pay, you know, the thirty thousand dollars it's going to cost them to put a place a magazine and an ad, um, place a, an, a full page ad in a magazine for a coupon um plus the twenty percent i refer a friend refer a ref, a friend massage special so listen no offense but basically you're saying okay if you tell a friend about this massage in a resort in the caribbean they get twenty percent off that's not a good deal. I mean, so you're basically telling people that you're going to give them 20% off a massage if they travel to the Caribbean and stay in this resort. Okay, not a good plan, Celia. I um, really think this went out. I went back in your week one and looked through your, um, um, back in the uh, creative brief, and and you you say you want to do a, um, a promotion. And then I, and I responded by saying, can you be a little more specific in describing the type of promotion or package deal you want to offer? And this is exactly why, because we need really need to get this thing um, developed. Okay, we're going to be moving on to the banner very soon. So let me make some recommendations. If you just go take a look at a, a magazine ads for tropical resorts, you can see that most of them are, are relying on image. And I think that's smart for a tropical resort um, because it's, it's all about visual. Do you see what I'm saying? So why, I mean, any client can put a purple block in their ad, but you've got this wonderful opportunity to use these amazing images that are available in the in the Caribbean, um, specifically available to resort goers. So you can use that to entice. The reason I'm th going through this is I'm just looking at ads and seeing how a lot of ads are really um, depending on the image. Okay, there's a, a, an image, then a logo, then, then the text. Okay, image, logo, text. Image, text, logo. So a lot of them are really depending on image um, quite heavily. And I'd like to see you do the same with your work as well. Um, all right, any questions or comments, please get with me, and I will be glad to um, um, assist you further. Okay, thanks very much.